we're getting in some breaking inputs. This with regards to the Gujarat riot case. The Gujarat government has now filed documents before the Supreme Court pertaining to the probe in the case against Tista Setalwad for allegedly fabricating documents to implicate high government functionaries with relations to the 2002 riots in Gujarat. The Supreme Court will be hearing Tista Setalwad's bail plea tomorrow. For more details, let's quickly go across to Ananya Bhatnagar, our legal correspondent who's joining me on the phone line. Ananya, while you throw light on what these documents are that have been filed before the court, important to also talk about why the interim protection for Tista Setalwad had been uh, uh, extended by the apex court. Well, uh, you know, um, uh, if you remember that there was a late night hearing that happened at the Supreme Court. In fact, not only one, but uh, two uh, late night hearings that took place before the topmost mm. court of the country. Um, uh, and uh, then uh, interim protection was granted, in fact, uh, uh, to Tista Sidbat for a week, and then that was extended. Uh, but if you remember that this case actually cropped up after the Supreme Court had given out its judgment in the 2002 Gujarat riots case, clearly telling and, and, in fact, observing that, you know, there were certain kind of people who were in involved in fabricating evidences and tutoring witnesses, uh, which, which led to a larger conspiracy to frame high officials of the Gujarat government, including uh, the then Chief Minister and the current Prime Minister, Mr. Narendra Modi. Uh, what, what is uh, also very crucial to note is that these documents have been filed before the topmost court of the country are uh, after the Supreme Court had actually issued notice on the Itas Edilwaj um, bail petition. And this is uh, what um, the Gujarat government has filed is uh, including the case diaries of that particular investigation that was done by, uh, in fact, uh, uh, the, uh, the Gujarat police. And also, in fact, uh, uh, these documents also would entail uh, how Tista Sitilwad and others were involved into a criminal conspiracy. So how, how would the... Uh, you know, the Gujarat government would be opposing this particular bail application. It's something that is that is something very, very crucial to see. It would be uh, Solicitor General Tushar Mehta along with the additional Solicitor General S.P. Raju who would be appearing for, uh, in fact, the Gujarat government into this particular case. And, uh, in fact, we might see uh, senior advocates using again coming up before the top poster of the country and arguing for uh, Tista Sitilwan into this particular case. So how things pan out is something that is a matter of time we'll get to know. However, since there is already an interim protection granted to Tista if at all the case does not reach a final conclusion tomorrow, uh, then also the same uh, could be extended by the top poster of the country. All the questions related to this would be answered tomorrow right. when the top poster of the country begins hearing this right. particular I'm case. I'm sure you'll be tracking all those latest developments for us.